Hello friends, and welcome back to The Road to Calvary. I've been waiting patiently for you. Today, before we even get started, I wanna tell you guys something really, really awesome. You may or may not know that I'm doing two other devotionals just like this, where I'm on this side of the screen and the person who's listening is on the other side of the screen. I'm doing two other ones for maybe people who are a little bit older, right? So I'm doing two others and you guys, you guys are the ones who are reading the most amount of scripture. Isn't that awesome that you and I are spending more time in God's word than the other two Bible devotions? Amazing, right? Let's do a high five. Should we do that? Boom, high five. I am so proud of you guys. And today we get to read a bunch more verses together. We're gonna take our Bibles and we're gonna open them up to Luke 22 so that we can read verses 54 through 57. And we're gonna be listening for a charcoal fire. So let's take our Bibles and let's get them all opened up to Luke 22, 54 through 57. I've got my Bible right here and I'm going to start reading. Then they seized him and led him away. They grabbed onto him and they led him away, bringing him into the high priest's house. And Peter was following at a distance. Yep, it's that same Peter who had the sword before. Yep. And when they had kindled a fire in the middle of the courtyard and sat down together, Peter sat down among them. Then a servant girl, seeing him as he sat in the light, looking closely at him, she said, This man was also with him, him being Jesus. But Peter denied it, saying, Woman, I do not know him. Oh no, Peter. First you swing your sword around and then you say you don't know Jesus. Ooh, Peter's having a rough day, for sure. Jesus is too, but oh, Peter is having a rough day. So now let's see what our devotional would have to say to us. Okay, friends? It says, um, oh, so you see that there is a fire here in the high priest courtyard. It's supposed to be there. It's in a fire pit. Mm-hmm. And as we look, Is that Peter, the disciple, standing there trying to keep warm with the other people? Be careful, Peter. Jesus warned that you would be tempted to deny him. Be careful, Peter. Oh, does that ever happen to you? You think that you are just part of a friendly group and then temptation happens. And before you know it, you may be doing something you shouldn't. Maybe even something that you have been warned against and promised that you would never do that thing. Just like we told Peter to be careful. I'm going to tell you, be careful. And now you can tell me, be careful. Yep, we can learn a lot from Peter, can't we? Let's go ahead and pray, friends. Thank you for the warnings you give us, Jesus. Help us choose our friends wisely. In your name we pray, amen. Amen. That is a good prayer. Help us, Jesus, to choose our friends wisely, for sure. I love you so much, my friends. I have chosen wisely. And I will meet you back here tomorrow on the road to Calvary, and we will see what we can see tomorrow. Bye, friends.